G'day. Welcome back to Minecraft Down Under. Uh, this is episode 91. I almost got it wrong there. <laughs> Flame and Glar. Now, guys, before we get started, obviously, you may hear a croak in my voice right now. I have been feeling under the weather recently, so I do apologize because I think some people are like, what's wrong with Data's voice? If you don't say anything, if you don't say anything, well, obviously, people are like, what's wrong with Data's voice? So I, ha I thought I would say that right away, but anyway, yeah, so I'm not feeling the best. <laughs> it sucks, too. It's right next to Christmas. Oh, flame and galah. Anyway, guys, welcome to tonight's episode. Um, I, got, I got something so cool to show you. So, so cool to show you tonight. We got some redstone to play with, and it's Friday. Yay, Friday. Everybody's happy. It's Friday. Flame and galah. Well, how many days to Christmas? Not, not many. Flame and galah. So, all right. I, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to show you this. I have to show you something epic. Are you ready for this something epic? We've we've been working on this thing for many episodes now, and I think the bee sanctuary turned out way better than anybody could expect. Are you ready? I'm excited. This is awesome. This is a lot of work. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Welcome to the entrance. Yeah, you can see the entrance. Welcome to the entrance. Don't worry the rest of the stuff. I'll, I'll remove that later, but welcome. Check this out. There you go. Have a look at that. What do you guys think of this? Could you just imagine it in shaders right now? How flaming awesome is this? This is what we've been working on for many episodes now. And she is pretty much done and dusted. Look at this. How awesome is this? The tops are all done. I put little arches in for extra lighting. I was going to put lamps in, then I thought to myself, no, I'm going to go for more for arches. And they, they turned out so well. Every type of flower you can imagine. Um, every bee beehive is now hooked up. We just got to breathe them a little bit more, I must admit. The ends are now done and dusted. Oh, it's flaming brilliant. How how nice is this place? I think I think we've done really well. This is the ultimate bee sanctuary. I just love it. Zzz, I love it. So obviously Minecraft uh, 15.1 has 1.15.1 has come out. It has fixed a lot of the lag issues. Nice and smooth now around the base. But yeah, I'm sorry. I just I'm taking it all in because this we have been working on this and she's finally done. Absolutely stunning. Huge bee uh, sanctuary here. Uh, but I, I had to change a couple of things before people notice. I did, I, I had bamboo um, scaffolding as legs for the beehive. But unfortunately, we couldn't do that because I needed to put fires permanently underneath the, the boxes. So what I went and did is I went and just put some trapdoors on, as you can see, just to sort of hide it. I couldn't put it on the edges, unfortunately. So it does look like it has a couple of legs holding it up, but it looks good from the front, if you know what I mean. So... Any suggestions on how to make it look a lot prettier, I'm open to. So please put comments below if you do find anything way more way more better. But we can literally, every single one is like that, so we can harvest on the fly now. Um, I don't have the shears with me, but I've got, I've got some honeycomb. But yeah, we can harvest on the fly now and not have to worry about getting stung. Uh, yeah, it's bloody brilliant. I just love it. They fly up into the, to the top area, they pop in and out, and harvest the it's freaking awesome i i love this the bee update was definitely cool and i love this build as well pop yeah I, I love when you see them all out i've got about five or six of them look there you go there's many bees out right now i love when you see them flying around and yeah it's flaming awesome let's see if we can't breed a couple more come on list bee. yeah don't breed him with your sword oh he's going up you gotta come back down i got i got a flower for you Ah, oh, bugger. Okay, no breeding. We've only got one over here, and it's baby. Hello, you. Hello, you lot. <laughs> That's bloody brilliant. Now, oh, if we can get this other one down, we might be able to breed a couple more. But he's just, he's just loving it up there. You having fun, little guy? You want to come down for me? Oh, did, was that another pop? Oh, yep, yeah, it was. 
Come here. Oi. Are you big enough? Yes, you are. Oh, where did the other one go? Oh, 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 hello. You breed you and I can't breed you. Oh, oh, get out of the way. Oh, there you go. Look at them all. <laughs> How freaking awesome is this? How awesome is this? They're everywhere. I'll just keep breeding them and we'll keep getting more and more bees. But anyway, yes, Podzel is in the main beds instead of grass. Was suggested that grass doesn't really belong uh, doesn't really belong in the um, beds there. So we obviously went with Podzel. And then we went with uh, uh, brick here right around to so frame it. And uh, then we installed, obviously, the um, arches here with hanging lanterns. That actually brightens all this up so there's no spawnable spots, which is great. And then we've got, the obviously, the, the things we worked on last episode as well. But hopefully, guys, hopefully this was up to your expectation expectations here of this build. Actually, I, I think I've been far past it. Just being honest, like, man, this is going to look so, so sexy once uh, shaders... Are, we put shaders on, I reckon this place would look stunning with a flyby. F stunning. But there you go. That is literally the Bee Sanctuary, the ultimate one. And they're free range, they're not caged at all. I think that's bloody awesome. There we go. So we're going to leave this alone. Yep, we've been working on this freaking giant greenhouse for many, many episodes now. What I want to do now is I want to work on the bypass um, for fuel. And so, yeah, we're going to play with some redstone. Yay, back to some redstone. And then, you know what I was thinking? You know what would be really cool? If we could bring back a couple of parrots and bring them in here too for the noise and just, just to have them around and put them inside the bee sanctuary here. I think it would be bloody brilliant to have them sitting around here. It would be, it'd be awesome just to add those to the list. But hey, one thing at a time, one thing at a time. So let me go ahead and we'll head inside now and I'll show you what I mean about the bypass. Yes, finally, back inside. Been working on that freaking greenhouse for, for what, three, four episodes now? But we got it done and it looks bloody good. Many, 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 many hours went into that thing. We built most of it on a live stream too, so at least we could point people that way. All right, let's throw. Um, the, the the hay bales are from uh, village, nearby villages, by the way, before anyone asks, because I collect them for our cow farm right now, break them down. We don't really have a wheat farm currently, so um, the hay bales do me... Every time I find a village, I always take the hay bales. Running around finding all the bloody flowers... A little bit difficult. <laughs> We're not really close to any flower biomes, if you know what I mean. So anyway, let's plop all this in here. Boom, 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 boom. I think I'll swap out my pick because yeah, I've got I've been using my silk touch, but pop that in there, that in there, that in there, that in there. Okay, and we'll just pop this in there for now. All right. So now what we what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab some reds. No, I think we need a we need a plan. We need to plan. So come on down over to the XP bank. Now, this XP bank has been the best thing I ever installed. Just so you know, when we do start another season late, way down the track, we're going to definitely build an XP bank ASAP. Because every time I need to repair something or make a new tool, I just come down to the XP bank and grab as much XP as I want. There's probably, like, there's probably 500 plus levels sitting in the bank right now ready to go. It's bloody amazing absolutely amazing this thing the problem the problem i'm having right now not with the xp bank with the bamboo um my my entire base runs off bamboo you know which is really good but um last episode we had we started having problems with the bamboo uh, not last episode when we we'll smelt in the glass for the greenhouse our super smelter here yep our super smelter runs off bamboo which is great problem is it run it's running really really low so um, yeah, so it's running really, really low of bamboo. So what I was thinking is if we could hook up a lever, yeah, if we could hook, hook, if we just pull a lever and it's literally, instead of sending, sending all the fuel to the storage, it sends all the fuel over here to, and gets stored over here to fill up. If you know what I mean? Yeah, that would be freaking awesome. So we have a lever changing it like a bypass sort of thing. Um, I think that would be bloody awesome. And uh, yeah, so there's still been no good suggestions for the floor down here because obviously that needs to be done really soon. I've been, as you can see, working on all the, um, yeah, literally working on all the bloody the, the, the filters down here as well. 
So, what we'll do is go grab some Nicky Knacks. What we're going to need for this... Oh, we need a plan first. Yeah, you can't just... You can't just... Well, how's it going? Wow. Okay, so this is Cactus. Cactus. This side is... Um, this is Bamboo. So I definitely need to run it sometime. Yeah, I, I definitely need to run this bloody thing. Fill it back up sometime. Crikey. Remind me to do that. Actually, how long has this lasted? Guys, do you remember the last time we turned it on? Far out. That's cool. That is definitely, definitely cool. Um, so come back here. Oh, we need a plan. So how to bypass this? We could put a... So we've got three outputs here. This is exactly why the drainage is all over the place. So we've got three outputs. Yeah, we got three outputs, right? Right, okay. So as you can see, bamboo is flooding three li lines here. Maybe if we had the line down below... No, that's probably too low. Yeah, that'll be too low. Um, we need something a lot higher. And how would you switch it? Ah, oh, okay, so... we've Yeah, we... That's, yes, we've got to use our thinking power. Um, hmm. Let me think. I think I... Uh, okay, wait, wait, wait. I might have a plan. Yes data might have a plan so this top row here right spreads all the bamboo across our huge storage system right this this top line but this line here sucks it in so what happens if we put a redstone signal to this entire line here all the way along it's a bit longer than 15 um yeah a bit longer than 15 but obviously then items wouldn't get sucked into it, right? So that means all the bamboo would probably travel off the top and keep going. Ah, I'm getting a plan now. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Yes, I am definitely getting a plan now. That That's good plan. And then we just sort of take it off. So when we want bamboo to go to our other areas of the base we hit a lever redstone powers his entire line and bamboo just runs off the top and then obviously yes we'll have to find put in the lines for it but holy smokes you know yeah i think i think i think i think that's a really good plan for here that's probably a really good plan so let's start with putting the redstone in i think the redstone testing it making sure obviously that system that we just suggested works and uh, then we'll go from there. So what we'll do, grab some repeaters, check. Grab some redstone, check, check, check. And grab some hoppers. Uh, whoops, wrong one. Hoppers, check, 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 check. Excellent. Now, uh, do we have access to a, a lever of some sort? And we'll just take... No. Okay, fine. You know what? We'll just make one. That's fine. All right, no, no big deal, no big deal. All right, so we'll get a lever here. There we go. Switch it in, and there. So that's all we're going to need for now. All right, uh, maybe some redstone torches. Forgot that. If we're going to do this, we're going to do this properly. So I'll grab some torches. Boom. All right, let's head back on over there right now. Okay, let's go down. So we're going to be hooking. Oh. I just thought, we're going to need some blocks to hook this lever in, aren't we? You silly goose. I'm kind of um, rushing. I shouldn't rush. Look, look, there's some chisel. There's some normal. There's some... There's... Bob's your uncle. Didn't have to go too far. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. So let's go ahead and um, head back down. And head on. Um, maybe we should start downwards, upwards. Where is the redstone? Does anyone remember that? So if we're going to add another lever, holy smokes, this is going to be like a control panel, but we would obviously break this block, and we would put a chisel in, and we would put the lever in. So, power it. Okay. So that would be in off mode right now. All right. So, we'll always break this bit, just to sort of see where we are. And hopefully we can dig back down to it. So, where is it? Where, what is up here? Oh, the redstone. Oh, be, be, be careful. Yep, be careful. So that's one line. Where's the second line? Does anyone remember the second line? Oh, that sort of goes down. Oh, that's fine. Oh, 
I think I found it. Yes, I did. I'm trying not to break any redstone blocks. I'm sort of digging around there. I think people are probably like, eh, Daddy, you're going to break some redstone. I think, yeah. All right, so put that in there. That turns off the torch. Put another torch in here. That there will obviously control our redstone, right? Right. Um, oh, well, another block in here. They're, they're my bad. All right, so that's now good. Do we need it off mode? We need it off. Whoopsie. Uh, so we need to put another redstone torch in here to just get inverted. So now if we take this sucker up into the roof here, where are we breaking out? Where are we breaking out? Data, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, I think we're getting a little bit far. Oh, oh no. Perfect. This is it? This is it. So crack this open. There's, there's the line. Oh, this is the line. Perfect. All right, let's create some space for us to put this line in. See, this is where I'm going to run the redstone. Oh, no. I'm going to run the redstone line in here because when we're powering the block below it, it should power this block on the side, leaving this line open for us, if you know what I mean. Don't worry. We'll make sure she works before going too, too far. Got to be careful of water too because if I remember correctly, we built this thing. Wait, actually, why am I making a double lane? There's no point. Uh, we built this thing very, very close to the water, uh, the, the the ocean. So, you know, we've got to be freaking careful. Uh, we don't want to spring a leak, break all our redstone, because we already know this from past experience. They just don't mix. Uh, we'll put this proper block right out the end. Okay, let's put a test hopper in here. Boom. And break that up. Oh, oh, crikey, that's going to block the system now. Okay, so now any... Okay, so now we need to run redstone. Oh, yes, we do. So now we need to run redstone. So we'll put the signal redstone repeater in here. Uh, oh, no, here. There, because it needs to be powering that block, right? So it only goes 15. Well, um, let's do... No, no, wrong, 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 wrong. Data, slow down. Calm down. Um, okay, well, can I have this back then? All right, there we go. Now we can sort of we zigzag it down and make this bloody thing work. Ah, trying not to build any huge... There we go. Up, 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 up. Cooked in. So let's turn that on, uh, if we can. So I need to turn it on. Oh, down we go. Ouch. All right, come out. Down we go. Now switch the lever. This will be... This would be sending it to because these are off, these are all off off. Uh, that would be in on 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 state. So we need to send this sucker if we can. Whoop whoop. Oh, get rid of that. There we go. So yeah, it's on. That's perfect. So all this power all these blocks. Let's just remove this and put it to normal cobble. All the way along. That should be now powering the, the hopper next to it. Whoa. Okay, so we need to extend that. But we still need to power the block. So you, could, you can't just put a repeater in here. The block underneath would not be powered. You still need to power that block. Which is no problem. Just do that. And you can literally just do a, 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 a workaround. Which is no problem like that. And that is a little bit dodgy. But it works. You're still powering that block, right? Yep. So we're taking power from that block. And just transfer it into that block and we're putting it over the top. So this will obviously not send the signal back because if you bypassed it with a redstone around it, that would be bad. You would have a loop and you would create a permanent on state. So now this should reach all the way to the end. Dun, 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 dun. Perfect. Okay, so yep, right to the end. So, no... Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm thinking now. So no bamboo should make it into the chest they should just go off the top and to the end that is going to be our ultimate result right right so let's go turn her on guys big fat warning to everybody it's going to be bloody loud it's going to be real loud so i do apologize how can we get down there real quick uh down here down here <coughs> all right let's just turn the bamboo on ready Bamboo is now going on. It's this one here. Zero tick farm now on. Okay. Up we go. Chugga, 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 chugga. So sorry about the noise, guys. And the lag, actually. That is... Yep, that's running perfectly. Oh, damn. It's so laggy. All right. 
That's perfect. Make, I was just making sure I turned on the right one, by the way. <laughs> I was worried it was the cactus one. Now come back up here. Yeah, it's definitely working, but that... Oh, look at all the lights. Look what it's just done to it. All right, now let's go ahead and get back up. If we, ah, we can. I, it's so laggy. I can barely play. I can't even hear anything. Hopefully you guys can hear me. I do apologize. All right, let's get back up here. Check this. All right. I'll go right to the ends. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, yes. It is working. There you go. We are getting the zero tick bamboo flooding in and not straight down. So there's the zero tick running right now. All the stuff is coming down here. How freaking awesome is that? So the bear, the literally the bypass is working completely fine. This would technically go to a different storage right now. No problem. A little bit slower because it's only one hopper line. Remember, underneath we got three times. But that's perfect. That is absolutely flaming perfect. We got it right. Yay! Let's go turn this bloody noise contraption off and turn off the bypass for now. So down we go. Wow, with the lag. Oh, jeez. Down we go. Turn off the farm and off the bypass for now. So that's all offline. Now we figure. Now we need to sort of figure out how the flame and galah are we going to get... Oh, man. How the flame and galah are we going to get down... Uh, this this hopper line now down to where we need it. That's going to be the next hard, hard, hardest thing. So now we have a switch and on and off thing, and it goes down here no problem. Um, we could probably just transfer this actually down into the storage. There you go. Have it, Mr. Storage. Ah, bugger. It's not sucking it up fast enough. That's okay, because I wanted to do it. Actually, we come in one. I was going to do a sharp turn, but then I realized don't do that data. So let's do some digging. Let's play find the find, accidentally find the redstone on the other side. Well, we found a cave. Knowing my luck, I'm going to hit. I'm literally going to hit one of my sorting system. If I can know where that is, I'm right. I'm like set from then onwards, if you know what I mean. So I'm going to take a right now, a sharp right. Now let's see what we dig into. Just be careful, data. Slowly, don't break anything. Oh, there's so much redstone and so many hopper lines and so much lines of everything. We just don't want to dig into anything. That's all. No. Nope. Why do I... Oh, hello. What is this? What is this? A corner of something. What is this? Oh, that is the corner of the storage system. Because, yep. Yeah, this is the... Yeah, that should be if I'm correct. Yes, that is. Okay. Double check. That is definitely the corner of the storage. That means we are going the right way. Don't go that way. Seal that bad boy back in. Boom, boom, boom. Sealed, right? So we need to run it directly this way now. I'm not even sure what we're going to hit next, but hey, we'll find out. Oh, wait. One sec. Before I continue, because if I'm going to run a hopper line, what level is this on? Because if we run the hopper line at head height, it's going to really interfere with our storage. What, what, does anyone remember what level that's on? It's the bottom, like the leg height. It's perfect. That's one gap. Oh, leg height. Leg height. Oh, to go, to go, to go. Don't have to move it. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Totally cool. All right, swing around. Go through. Just keep going. So this here, we should end up down. If we keep on going, we should end up at... Oh, we might break into the water. Uh, the oh, water elevator flame and galah be really really careful oh jeez. oh man i just want to rush it but i know for a fact i could probably break something if don't be a little bit careful oh there's more storage what is this oh that's a top storage i thought i was hitting the bottom storage guys i was mistaken that's actually the top level storage not the bottom level storage okay all right no problem this, that means I don't have to make a water elevator. That means we're the right height. And hello, sexy. And I'm not meaning Venom. I'm meaning the uh, super smelter. Um, okay, so this is it, guys. Oh, did that just accidentally? Yes, grab that. So there she is. That is what we're after. Perfect. Yes. I love when things come together. 
Mm, okay. So now, I don't bump anything. Come down. Just go around here. So maybe, let's get our shulkers back, can we? We should get our shulkers back. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give nope, got none of them back, didn't I? Oh yeah, flame and fruit loop. It's gonna turn on. Oh, great. Yeah, well they ended up in the system somewhere. Remind me to take those out. To take those take those out. They would probably be down here. Aha! Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Wow, this one's full. That one's semi full. Wow, that one's drain drained. See, that one's freaking it's not all spread equally. Wow, that one's nearly empty, that one's nearly empty, that one's nearly... Okay, I get the drift. Now, with this system, leave it on for an hour. Every single one of these double chests are going to be full in no time. So, we just need to hook up all... So, what I would do is we just need to hook up... Yeah, we just need to hook up this. That needed some too, but I'm not too worried about that yet. Yeah, let's not stress about that, eh? Let's not stress about that. Let's just go here. Boom. Yep. So all the all the freaking bamboo goes down there. Can we manage to get it? Uh, is that the right height? Oh, do not remove the water salt. Oh, can we remove that? I think we can. Yeah, that can go. Bye-bye. So we need sort of it to come... What level is this? Perfect. So bring this back. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I don't know what that is. <laughs> oh, jeez. All right, so bring this back. Go this way for now. Go up for now. I'll remove those blocks because I don't know if they're going to affect anything, you know? Flame and glass. So keep going back this way. That shouldn't affect anything. And back this way. And we sort of need to come over the top now. So let's remove that. Yep, got that back. Which What, what blocks did we place? That one? That one. Yep, perfect. Oh, do we need to leave that one there? No. Okay, I'm just worried about affecting, so that should be fine. So bring this back now. Yep, just keep bringing this back. Yep, beep, beep, back it up. So it's going to be a bit of a hopper a hopper line, but flame and galah. Have we got the setup now? We just one lever, we can literally fill up, whoopsie, we can literally fill up our our fuel supply for the freaking um for the for the smeltery how cool is that i think that's brilliant with a zero tick farm and that still works in 1.15.1 which is good all right so bring it back this way we're doing good all right, beep beep keep backing it up all right we're almost there all right and then we'll switch it on and make sure she all works. Yay for more lag and more more noise. Oh, flame and galah. Just keep bringing it back. Oh, we're almost there. It's actually not bad. How many hoppers did we use? Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. I thought there was going to be a little bit more to it. But there we go. So bypass is now successfully installed. Let's go give this a freaking whirl, shall we? Let's go see if this works. Yep, let's go see if this works. All right, so... We need to go... Can we get out of here somehow? What is even this? I think we had to remove that at some point. Whatever. Down we go. Some sort of hole. Yep. Alright. Lovely. Perfect. Alright. So let's go ahead. Let's test it without the bypass. Make sure she's working. Okay. So I do apologize to everybody for the noise. And I... I, I, I yeah. Sorry. That's all I can say. Sorry for the lag and sorry for the noise. I'll try to talk up a little bit. But here we go. Go ahead and switch the on. We won't put the bypass on yet. I'm just going to make sure that it's going into the storage as it should. Okay. So, flame and galah. Up we go. Up we go. So, it should all be coming down back to this point. And it is. Is it going into the storage? Yes, it is. Bamboo. Bamboo is flooding into the storage. Is exactly what we want. Yep, flooding in. It's going down into the actual system there. Which is perfect. So go around. Look. Okay, so there's, as you can see, nothing in the hopper line. They are all going down to that point there. So they're going down exactly what we want. So now let's throw the lever back down these weird lots of holes that I've got everywhere to the triple bypass. And now switch this sucker here. 
That there now will should put it into the bypass mode, which now will send. If we go up here, double check everything, will now send the bamboo along the line. Yes, this thing is bloody brilliant, guys. And it should be. Yep, flooding out the flooding out there. Look at that. That is brilliant. As I said, the the line may not keep up though. So eventually, I think. Sorry about the noise again. Um, I think these might build up because yeah, we have a triple emptying system. Yeah, see, we got build up already. Look at that. The line is not taking it, but that's fine. Let the line build up. That's totally cool. Uh, that's totally cool. Now let's go down to the. Yep, let's go down. Let's go up and over. Yes, Gamora. That's me kitty in the background meowing. Let me in. Go let her in. You let, her let her in. in. I just threw her out. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, that's Venom. Um, okay, so downstairs. Downstairs. Somebody says, Huskman said, I thought they were fixing zero tick. No, they fi They. F Sorry. Let me clarify. There was another zero tick farm that got invented with sand and a uh, falling sand and um oh what is it falling sand in a boat it's two three times faster um if it's two two three times faster than a zero tick farm so mojang thought this was obviously way too overpowered because zero tick farms are already fast enough and they patched out the boat sand zero tickness <laughs> i don't even know what to call it just being totally honest with everybody but there you go so they did fix that part but they didn't fix the zero tick at all all right, I'm here. Where's the fuel? Yep. The fuel is cut flooding into the ends. That's brilliant. We won't see the fuel come all the way, but this thing should just keep, like, every time a fuel hits the end here, it will separate it. Remember, they're all cut flooding down the line right now. They get to here. It goes over the top and then comes back over. Yeah. There you go. Working brilliantly. We are currently... We are currently, guys, getting fuel, just constant fuel into the line. That's bloody brilliant. Just remember how this system works, this spreader that we got. Hey, Gamora. If I had a webcam on right now, you'd look cute. Um, yeah, so how this system actually works is the, the, this line here, this entire line fills up with, well, now, bamboo. So just say every single hopper will have a bamboo in it. And we'll get all the way to the end, right? A stack of bamboo is spread out between all these hoppers. Gets all the way to the end. Triggers it. This little guy here goes over the top. Sucking it out of every single hopper. Transferring it to the bottom hopper. Spreading it out. That's literally how it works. It's I got a tutorial for this entire system. Um, so, yeah, make sure you check that out. If you, if you need... If you want to build one of these industrial uh, bamboo uh, smelters, I've got a tutorial for it. But there you go. So now, we did it. We absolutely did it. We smashed it. We now have a bypass system. I love it. So that means, I'm, I'm happy. I'm super duper happy with what we just done. That's bloody brilliant, guys. Love it. Now we have, we have that system. Let's go turn off the lag generator. <laughs> That's what it is. Yep, it's still running as we speak. Let's go ahead, turn it off. Turn it off. Excellent. We're going to have to put signs in eventually. We keep, we keep adding to this bloody thing. We're going to need to put some signs in. We've got now another freaking control panel. Uh, that is flaming awesome. It's off-centered though. It's driving me up the wall. I think that is freaking awesome. I think I'm, I'm happy with what we just did. Let's go ahead and seal that bad boy back up. So, what I'm probably going to do now, guys, is I'm probably going to, like, literally, maybe tonight, I'm going to maybe AFK and let our, our super smell to fill up to its chockers. Yep, I think that's probably going to be a good deal right there. And just le and then switch it over and let the other ones fill up too. And then, you know what? Guess what? Even if, even, you know what the best thing? Even if our big storage fills up, it's an overflow. So, it gets right to the end and guess what? It goes over anyway. How freaking awesome is that? See? Or two birds, one stone. Bloody brilliant. All right. I think that's enough with the redstoning for now. Well, yeah. Well, that's enough for the redstoning. Let's go ahead and move on to something else. I think it's time to go out to the jungle and see if we can't tame uh, us some parrots to for our greenhouse. That would be freaking awesome. Um, yeah. So what I'll do is just dump all this out. 
Dump it all out. Yep, go ahead, dump it all out. Uh, I'll throw this through the sauna later on. Don't worry too much. Uh, yep, we'll just throw some in here. There we go. Got our shulkers back, which is probably brilliant. All right, swap those out. Lovely. Perfect, 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 perfect. Okay, so let me sleep. I'll head over. What I'll do is get on a jump cut. Let me sleep, and then I'll head over to the jungle, and we'll hunt some down. We need some seeds, but we could always break the grass and, and stuff around us. We'll, we'll find some seeds. But anyway, let me get that get over there, and then we'll uh, we'll get we'll see if we can't tame some. If we can't find any, well, oh, geez, well, I don't know. Sometimes a an entire jungle doesn't have a parrot. Not even kidding. You get the rare spawn, the rare seeds that you will look through an entire jungle, and maybe not even have a parrot. Uh, maybe just cats, but yeah, we'll see. All right, guys, I'll be back shortly. All righty, guys, I am back, and I've managed to get myself straight across the uh, icebergs and everything else, the shipwrecks, and we've gone to the jungle. Now, straight away, I've already spotted one. I'm oh, legit. Straight in front of me. Actually, it's two. I didn't even see the blue one there. I spotted a rainbow one, and I thought, flaming galah, I better get off this uh, jump cut, because you know who's going to believe me, but yeah, I, I wasn't this lucky in season three, uh, season two of MDU, I had to travel for miles, hello, can I get close to them, I got seeds, I just need, we need to, we need to, yeah, oh, hello, <laughs> yeah, Ah, and there you go. We have one. Hello, you. You're you. You really cute blue one. Come on. There we go. We have. Oh, we have two of them. Hello. Yep. Can we get a third? That would be awesome. Come on. Yep. Did I get it? I think I did because I can't click him anymore. There you go. I have three of them. Oh, is that another one? No. Oh, no, he teleported it. You no, know, he did. Huh? Is there more than I, I'm looking at? Like, flame and glare. All right, let's bring them out of here. They should follow us. Come on. Come on, you lot. Oh, teleporting, which is great. All right, let's stick, stick one over here on shore. Come on over. If we can get four, and you know what? Maybe we'll do a special on Sunday night where we'll pick... pick f oh, hello. We'll pick, sit down, good, good, work. good, good, uh, jump off, there you go, sit, we may pick four random people out of chat, live stream on Sunday night, and name them, that would be cool, I think we'll do that, I might get an extra one for the donator of the year, I have to do that too, I kind of feel obligated, but I think we'll pick, we'll get four of these guys if we can, bring them home, and name them on Sunday night, that would be freaking awesome right there guys, I think that's a good idea, especially, yeah, just pick four random people out of chat, but, oh, crikey, I didn't bring a bed, oh, nuts, this is going to be a tough night to survive, i got to get more seeds, though, which is no problem, actually, I might row back, the island near us, my farming spot has a bed, so what I'll do is probably far, row back there and grab them, so guys, I'm going to get on another jump cut, I'm going to get the get some more parrots and get them on home. So, I'll be back soon. Give me some seeds! Alrighty, guys, I am back. Now, I've managed to get several of these pain-in-the-bum birds back to the main base. So, a little bit of a trip, making them teleport from island to island, going back for th ones we've lost, etc, etc. But they're all sitting down, they're all nice and peaceful, ready to be name-tagged on Sunday night, and thrown in our beautiful greenhouse, which we have been working on for the last... A uh, few episodes, and yeah, for the latecomers, she has turned out absolutely stunning. There you go. Alright, time to go ahead and call it now. Thanks for watching episode uh, 91 here of Minecraft Down Under. Don't forget, if you're enjoying the content, make sure you smash those buttons. And uh, I'll see you all on Sunday night, and I'll catch you all later. <laughs>